making a black and white shader. So start by right clicking and creating a new material, a shader graph material. So go to shader graph, HDRP, and then unlit, create it, call it black and white shader, open it up. All right, now what we're gonna to wanna to do is get the scene color and then get the screen position as well. So let's go ahead and screen position, plug those into each other to get the color of every pixel on the screen. Now we're gonna to wanna to split it split it and then we're going to want the average between the three colors the intensity of each color channel so we can add the red and the green together and then we're going to add that to the blue as well and next step we want to get the average brightness the average general luminosity so we want to divide that by three because we're adding the red the green and the blue so let's clean it up a little bit now we're going to give that into a multiply this is only important if you're using hdrp we want to multiply it by exposure all right plug that into the actual base color clean it up a little bit more Move this just so everything looks a little clean for later. All right. Now we're gonna go ahead and group and do some commenting. So this is only needed for HDRP exposure. This area here is about calculating the overall intensity for each pixel between the three different color channels. So I'll call it something like this is pretty good. Yeah, brightness. Uh, and now we're going to go ahead and do just this for getting the actual color of every pixel that is being rendered. All right, one final thing we're gonna to have to do is go to the actual settings, the material type, uh, yeah, and transparent. Right click it, create a new material out of the shader, call it black and white material or something. All right, TC turns it gray, but now we're gonna create a new sphere just for testing purposes. Bring that over here in front of this crate. Maybe scale it up a little bit. And there we go. We have our sphere. Anything behind it is becoming black and white. And that's the shader. Thanks for watching.